Okay, this is Foul Play, which is a, a, a side-scrolling beat-em-up game. Um, I've played it for about 20 minutes. Uh, it's a... Uh, I wasn't really good at it, I'll be, I'll be honest. Don't expect great things. But yes, um, it's uh, another one of those games that I... Uh, I installed at the weekend, so I searched through my uh, Steam collection for things I bought in bundles and haven't played yet. Uh, it seems quite a fun one, my initial impression. Uh, so, the, the, the framing device is you're a, a Victorian gentleman uh, presenting a theatre performance describing his past adventures when he was defeating evil and, and doing various other things. So, the, the currency, the score, is how happy you make the audience. And you make the audience happy by uh, stringing together um, um, combos. Which is, you know, I've been playing a lot of uh, Batman, Batman Arkham Asylum recently, and this is a surprisingly similar game, albeit it's a 2D beat-em-up. So, uh, throw three enemies into breakable pops. So there's, there's a special move you can do you can throw, I can't remember what the key for it is right now, I think Possibly it's double B. Um, you get a perfect scene if you do all combos and don't get hit, I think. That won't happen in this video. Sure. Just so you know, right. So. Hello here. There we go. Look at that. And... Oh. I've lost my combo. Let's try it again. Got one of them down. Defeated them all. Right. So that wasn't particularly brilliant. You have to press. Um... Let's see if I can catch him. There we go. Them. So this is my problem. I missed them. Ah, times 11. Splendid! And you see the audience is here. Is a... There we go. I'm throwing them out nobody's business. Got them to hit each other. When they hit you, it breaks a combo. I'm sorry I'm not talking too much. Well, maybe, maybe you prefer it that way. Well, let's just keep my trap shut. But I'm having to concentrate to actually uh, do the things. So uh, a bit like Batman: Arkham Asylum. I don't know if I can interact with any of that stuff. A bit like Batman Arkham Asylum. You see the players creeping off the uh, actors. It's it's as much down to timing. Oh. It's as much down to timing as it is to uh, anything else. So button mashing, which is my uh, principal approach to these games, is less effective than uh, than timing it correctly. 
Pressing the wrong button. Oh, let's throw an enemy into a prop. There we go. Oh, I'm up to 20. How exciting. So there's a meter at the top of the screen there that you can probably more easily pay attention to. Ooh, three in a reason to break all pops. Ooh, soldier gets up. There we go. You can more easily pay attention to than uh, I can. <laughs> the hook pulling people off. It is quite amusing, some of this stuff. That was a cannon. There's a cannon. Can I throw someone into the cannon? Oh. Ah. I've got up to 30 something there. That's really impressive for me. Hey, I threw three enemies into breakable things. Oh, missed him. Hey. I'm just bouncing them off each other at the moment. Didn't time that right. Up to twenty. Ah. Oh. So as you can see, it's uh, it's an arcade arcade game. Come here, you. Boom. An arcade game with a uh, interesting art style, interesting setting. Come here, you lot. I've been the crap out of a bit. Ooh. Hit right button to unleash a showstopper when this meter is full. Okay. Right button. Ah, oh, defeating them all. Excellent. And now we get a boss fight. Quickly, Scampwick. Inside. Right-o, sir. Ah. 
Cup of tea. Cup of tea. Get on. So there is a plot. Oh, I missed him. Oh. Again, I'm button mashing. Oh. I'm button mashing. Come on. So if they shoot things at me, I believe I can th throw it back. Oh no, missed it. Human cannibal. Go on, shoot something. Come on. Yes. I managed to throw it back. Come down there to destruct some things. There we go. Come on here, let's destroy some other things. Yeah. All right, so the crowd is really happy with me. I've defeated everybody. Let's defeat all these people. Yeah. Oh, I lost my combo. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, that was better. Go on, take a shot. Oh, I missed him. There we go. Bang! I'm getting the time a bit wrong on these things. So I think I'm fairly near to the end now. Oh, maybe not. Return where I hit the bullet back. Oh. When's it going to end? Let's just beat, beat them up for a bit. Can't beat them up on the rubble for some reason. Oh. Took a shot at me there and I missed it. Yep, got the cane pulling people off again. There we go. Stage going on in the background. Um. 
We have a bit of a plot going on. Someone take a shot at me. Get a combo up. Jump up. You take it. Crowd's still not very happy with me. This guy, come on. Yeah. Come on. More stage crash up. Boom. Oh, still alive. Ace return. It's coming. I'm guessing that means a boss fight. Get on. Yeah. It's been promised to me. Bear for a reason. No. these people at him. Oh, 
That seems to work. Nearly got him. There we go. Defeated. So that's it. I've done a level. It's taken uh, probably longer than longer than might have been necessary for the video. I didn't really say much because I was too busy doing stuff. But yeah, this is a uh, uh, two stars. 59 enemies, 34 greatest, not bad. And I've unlocked a new page. And a new mode. How exciting. And I managed to complete two of the challenges. Didn't get close to the perfect scenes though. Ah, showstopper. So this is my special moves. we go back to the main menu, you can see uh, my demon diary, which is which is your collection of stuff which you unlock, I'm guessing. There you go, so that's the bosses in there I've defeated. And the, uh, the throw at this juncture, it'd be a second time whilst pushing in a direction to hurl the attacker away from you. I didn't realise you could hurl him in a different direction of what you're facing. So that would help. Showstopper. My how to attract admirers with panache. So yes, I like I like the uh, the overall presentation of this game. It's very nice. Uh, the, the whole sort of uh, uh, faux Victorian adventurer adventurer feel of it. It's quite entertaining. The actual game itself, a bit frantic, uh, but also fun. And... Uh, you know, obviously I'm only getting two stars on it. It's potential to uh, to do uh, perfect games there and, and all that other good stuff, uh, I guess. Speed runs and things. Um, not getting hit if you you know actually pressing the buttons well rather than just banging away at them all like I do. Uh, um, very pleased to pick this up in general. Um, something to check out if you if you see it on the Steam store.